Okay, guys, I think you guys are going to set the record for the for the tallest guys we ever spoke to here on, uh, on West Ham TV. So, um, you guys are here. You only flew in from New York this morning uh, from the New York Knicks. Uh, just want to start, Jason, by telling us why you guys are here. Uh, we're here to play a game on Thursday against uh, the Milwaukee Bucks. Um, it's NBA in London. It's a great experience to be here. It's my first time being in London. Uh, happy to be here, that's for sure. First time seeing a soccer match or a football match. Um, but we're really excited to be here. We're having a good time um, hanging out with, as a team. You guys get to travel all over the country, over in the United States and obviously north of the borders of Canada, but this is uh, something only one or two teams get to do every year. How much are you enjoying the experience? I mean, I'm enjoying it a lot. I mean, uh, being overseas, being able to see a football game, it's, it's, it's a great experience. And uh, we're just soaking it all in and, and taking it moment by moment, really, and enjoying it. What have you managed to do today? I understand you, you pretty much got off the plane and practiced. <laughs> yeah, just got off the plane and practiced and uh, just been eating and trying to sleep, trying to catch up with sleep. But that's all right now. How about you? Uh, how much you enjoying being? I mean, you've only been here for probably about eight hours. Yeah, you know, it's my first time over in Europe. Um, you know, I'm very excited to be here, and you know, just traveling around London. It's been a great experience so far, even though we've only been here for a few hours. But uh, you know, definitely trying to catch back up on sleep. The Knicks have been over here recently, but you being a fresh-faced rookie, um, all the way from the West Coast where you yeah. went to college, yeah. um, obviously it's going to be a bit, bit of a different experience here in the British fans. I mean, I expect there'll be a lot of the Yanks there yeah. as well, but yeah. a bit of a different sort of game. Yeah, I'm definitely excited to see uh, what the atmosphere is going to be like at the game. Um, yeah, and I'm just uh, grateful to be here and grateful to be a part of this. It's always good, man, for my teammates to really come out and hang out uh, here in West Ham, man. It's, it's, it's a beautiful place and it's, uh, it's a fun soccer match. You, uh, you're a soccer fan, I understand. Yeah, I am. Yeah? So how did that come about? Well, uh, over time, just growing up in America, man, I think we watched a lot of soccer uh, coming up. And then now being around other uh, uh, colleagues who are, are truly intrigued with soccer or football. And, and so I happen to grow that type of love as well. I love this trip. I love the NBA in London. It kind of combines both of my worlds. So this is my second time here and both time I had to make sure I got to a football match because I know it's soccer back at home when I cover the Red Bulls but here it's the, the beautiful game of football. So I love the two worlds coming together and watching the basketball players really enjoy this game and then for me it's a chance sort of be a little starstruck and be a fan as well. And uh, we, when we were here two years ago we went to Chelsea, Chelsea Southampton game and today was great. We you know got to meet your players and uh, we actually ran into Tim Howard, an American, as he was going out to the field because he's not playing. So it's just, I love seeing the two sports collide.